Monday morning, Val has a uh, full-blown gastroparesis attack. Uh, she's taking her medication for that and it knocks her out so she's asleep. Today I am dealing with more paperwork, dealing with uh, um, more attempts at uh, looking for work. So um, that's what I'm doing. Paperwork has gotten kind of mixed up because things keep getting pushed around here. So first, before I can do anything, I have to find all my paperwork. It's been kind of scattered about. There's Epps trying to help me out. Look through that pile. I'll look through this pile. Let's go. So you're up. How you doing? Yeah. Meh. Yeah. Waiting for you to feed me bonbons and fan me. No bonbons or fans. Sorry. But I'm hungry. Um, uh, well, you've got a stomachache. I don't think bonbons would even be good for it. I know what would be really good for it. Not lobster. No. <laughs> My Chinese soup. Oh, that's too bad. Because I'm not going out to get it. Why? It's a beautiful day out there. It's raining out there. I know, it's beautiful. Well, then you go get your soup. Can I use the truck? <laughs> You'll have to walk. Me. <laughs> Trickles. Boom. Bow. Bow. <laughs> Freckles. Boom. Bow. <laughs> You're weird. Mm-hmm. Oh, weird. Well, we got to figure out what we're going to do for dinner tonight. All right. Because I'm hungry. What well, time is it? Uh, it is 5.30? Uh. 4.30? 4.30. Kevin on the phone trying to cancel AT&T. And they are trying to say, oh, we'll send somebody out and maybe give you faster upload speeds. Haven't we tried that already? Wouldn't you think we're normal people and think about that? Come on, just cancel us. I'm very, very sorry I disturbed you. You'll just have to live with it. Don't wink at me like that. It's not gonna work. No. No winking. It's not gonna help. No. No. <laughs> You're too cute, Boomer. Ooh, so cute, Boomer. So you ready? What? We need to shoot some tags today. Tags. And I want to do the whisper challenge. Yo, cat. No claws on my couch. Oh, oh, excuse me. Excuse me. Come on, you can get up. Oh. Come on, fat boy, you. Oh. You can do it! <laughs> it's raining outside! You can see the patio's all wet. Patio needs to be swept because of all these leaves everywhere. And I wish our patio roof didn't leak because then I could sit out here and enjoy the rain! But it leaks. So, no, I can't sit out here and enjoy the rain. Bye, rain. Hi. What you do, dear? Nothing. I'm just washing my hands. Just washing your hands. How come the water's a little uh, pinkish, reddish looking? The water's not any color but water. Uh huh. What you want to see it be another color? No, I don't. Uh, stop. So, you always know when you've. Uh, Really gotten into your projects <laughs> and you bleed on it. Fortunately, we have to eat this one. Well, I can rinse it off. off. I was just cutting up our, our uh, bell pepper. It's an orange bell pepper, too, so you can't really see the blood. Great. A little extra protein in the dinner. 
Can you get me a paper towel, please? Yes, dear. Well, hello, everybody. I am cooking some dinner, but it's not for nibbling Thursdays, nibbling with the neighbors on Thursdays. It's just yeah. cooking some dinner. So, I'm bleeding on it. Yeah, I cut myself. Looks like it's still pleading. Pleading. <laughs> Looks like it's still bleeding pretty good. Um, Megan and Brian ran to the store um, to get some stuff that I'm going to make tomorrow night for dinner, which will probably be filmed for nibbling with the neighbors. But meanwhile, I'm just going to... Cut yourself again? <laughs> no. Hopefully get everything ready for when they get home. We can eat. So, babe, how's dinner? Delicious. For a quick throw together? Yeah. Yeah. You're going to have people asking about this one. <laughs> this is pretty good. Well, tell everybody what it is. Uh, it's chicken, and I guess it is fried in um, olive oil. Olive oil and coconut oil, because I didn't have enough of one or the other, so I okay. mixed them. Uh, we have three different types of bell peppers and onions uh, all fried in there with it. Uh, with some uh, uh, onion, garlic, and, and garlic, and parsley, and it's pretty tasty. And mashed potatoes. Just a little bit of Val's blood. So. No, I washed all the blood out. Don't do that. <laughs> so, looks yummy, guys. I'll have to do this on one of my nibbling with the neighbors Thursday segments. Hello, everybody. Oh, wait. I don't know. You can't lean on that arm. I gotta have that arm under here. Why am I getting a Tasmanian devil? I just thought you needed one. Okay. Here, you can have that. Hi, everybody. It's time for... <laughs> neighborhood community shout-outs. Our very first shout out is a happy birthday shout out. She is going to be 30 years old tomorrow. So everybody say a big happy birthday shout out to Pammy Clinton. Are you sure you want it? You're 30 tomorrow because she was but 29 and holding for a long, long time. I still am. Oh, see? I'm only 29. And holding. There's no and holding. I'm only 29. That's yes, it. Period. Dear. Happy birthday, Pammy. <laughs> Happy birthday to you, Pammy. I hope it's a fantastic birthday party for you. Or a birthday for you. I don't know if you're having a party, but I hope it's a fantastic birthday. Amy Martin and Adam Dawkins. Adam's fairly new with us, but Amy's been around for a long time. And they need some subs on their channels. So I would like if everybody could possibly go over and check out their channels and see what they're all about. Give them a thumbs up. Subscribe if you like what you see and show them some love. And Amy is spelled A-M-I-E. Martin and Adam Dawkins is the other one. So they're awesome people. Go by and check them out. Oh, this one you can't read. One Ashley one says I should be able I should hypnotize you and make you take me to live with the polar bears. But when I just ship you there. No, put I you in a box. No. Well, no, listen. If I can hypnotize you to take me to live with the polar bears, I should be able to hypnotize you to do anything. Can you imagine the possibilities? This evil little mind is just Turning. Can you imagine? You're gonna give that that little squirrel in there a heart attack. I give him enough nuts. <laughs> I'm not gonna touch that. <laughs> Madeline R. C. I've probably done this before, but I know it's been a while because you, you've had an injury. So, welcome to the neighborhood. 
And glad you are healing up. She had two sprained ankles and has been laid up for a while. Yammy forever. Welcome to the neighborhood. And April K, this is getting serious now. Are you sure you want to go with two whole dozen? Think about it before you make that commitment. Okay? That's an awful lot. You know, just saying. You want to make sure you're sure. It's time for Neighborhood Community Credit Roll. Oh, and look at my thumb, everybody. She cut her thumb. Today. Yeah, and it's bleeding still. It's, it's bleeding pretty bad. So, there was only one other time that I cut my thumb this bad. And it's when I was up at Sarah's um, and we were peeling branches. With the kids, with the X-Acto knives. And I was teaching the kids, you don't peel towards yourself, you peel away. And I said, okay, this is how not to do it, because you can cut yourself. And I went, Psht, and I sliced my thumb. And it was bleeding, and it was the first night I ever like spent the night over at her house. And it was bleeding so bad, and she put... Um, Super glue on it and wrapped it in electrical tape because that usually helps. And it stopped bleeding. And then we took everything off. And I said, Look, Sarah, it's not bleeding anymore. And I said, And I picked at it. And it started bleeding again. And Sarah's like, Your husband is never going to let you hang out with me again. Knock it off! You are all part of our neighborhood community. Each and every one of you out there. We would not be here today if it weren't for all of you out there watching us. We love you. <laughs> we love you all so very, very much. Make sure you go by and check out your Kid Zoo, the Paranormal Investigation with the Neighbors. And we will see you all tomorrow. I love you tomorrow. You're only a day away. I hope we don't get sued for that. <laughs>